Hello everyone. Greetings from Elysian Technologies Private Limited. We are the leading telephony solution provider all over the world since 2007. We have our expertise in omni-channel contact center solution, CRM integration, help restricting system, voice broadcasting and many more. After completing successful integration with Zoho CRM, Sugar CRM, Suit CRM, V Tiger CRM and Lead Square CRM, Elysian has come up with another integration with Salesforce. Today, I will be sharing you an integration of Salesforce CRM with Dial3. Generally, call center solution is used to take care of both inbound and outbound calling and Salesforce CRM is used to store the information of customer or project. These solutions are used sometimes in real time during live call and sometimes once the call is hung up. We offer following benefits in this integration. Dial free CTI connector with Salesforce. That is agent interface within Salesforce so that agent don't have to use two different screen like dial free agent panel and Salesforce panel. Entire calling function will be operating from Salesforce panel itself. Click to call in Salesforce, streamline data in both systems, data push from Salesforce to dial tree and vice versa, detailed call logs in Salesforce CRM, pop up of the lead information page when an outbound call is placed. On receiving outbound call, customer details will be shown in Salesforce. Let me show you how it works. Firstly. We need to login into our Salesforce account using the login ID and the password. As soon as you log in, you will be able to view the Salesforce CRM account. Now let's move to the integration part. On my extreme left downward screen, you can see an option as dial free phone. That is a dial free CTI connector. Once we click on this tab, dial free CTI connector, which will fetch all the details of the user, which is which will be pre-filled into the login page, so that user don't have to remember or fill details manually. It will auto fill the credentials. After that, we will need to click on the submit option, and then we need to select. Now we will get a ring on a uh, registered software of the agent. Conference. Now we will select the in groups as well. So this is how uh, we can access dial tree agent panel from Salesforce CRM and start calling on the leads. On the top left, you can see a drop down as well. It states the statuses of the agents, whether he is on available mode or on pause mode. You can also search the lead using their name and number. As soon as you log in, you can do the auto calling from the system. You just need to be on the available mode and you can start the auto calling. You can search the lead using the name and the number. Let me search a lead uh, by my uh, number. As soon as I've called the lead, if uh, already the information will be pre-stored in the system, uh, the details will come up automatically over here in the CRM. I have received the call and I'm answering the call now. As soon as I've answered the call, you can see my de lead details which are automatically there in the system have come up over here. My uh, name, my phone number. Now. Uh, I'm still on a live call from past 25 seconds. It is a manual outbound call. I can also transfer the call to any department, to any agent or I can go on a three-way conference call with any person. There is also an option to put the customer on hold and once I have the information, I can grab the call. If we want to play any kind of jingle at the back end, this is also possible. 
I can disconnect the call as well using these below options. If I want to hang up my call, I need to click on this leave three way call when I'm on a conference call with me as an agent, you as a client and the third person, the external number is my manager. If I'm on a three way call, I want to leave my line. I will click on this leave three way call. If I want to hang up the third person or externals line, then I will hang up X for line. And if we all three are done for the call, I can hang up on both the lines over here. Now I will hang up the call over here. We need to select the hang up disposition, which means the reason to hang up the call. I will just hang up the call over here. Once my call is ended, I'm again on a ready mode. And if I want to again start uh, the manual dialing, I will click on the pause code. I will put the manual dial and I can start the calling automatically once again. We also have a functionality of click to call option. I'm going to the lead page now. I will just click on my number over here against my lead. As soon as I've clicked on my number, a call is made automatically once again to my number. I have received the call. I have answered the call now. So this is how uh, we can also use this functionality of the click to call option over here. So now uh, we are done with this demo session. I will now click on this log out option. I hope you like this demo session. For any kind of inquiries, please feel free to reach out to us at contact at Thank you so much.